and I love her so. I wouldn't trade her for gold. I'm walking on moonbeams, but I was born with a silver spoon. His music needed one thing, her. When your man's made up, when your man's you look at a film like Moulin Rouge and you go, I can see how that would become a big blockbuster Broadway West End musical. You look at once and you go, this, this could so easily go wrong. It was such a challenge that I thought this, this could be very interesting. Uh, from a writing point of view, it was all about actually just getting the out of the way and allowing the sort of story to sort of tell itself as simply as possible. I'm really grateful for the opportunity to sort of witness something that I, I was involved in a long time ago, th that it still has some kind of resonance with people that the story continued to be told. I was quite surprised how they were able to keep the simplicity of the movie intact within the play. This is something that we created that is now in the hands of these people who are doing a beautiful job. The show is, is based on the film, but it's like the show is, is, is kind of brought this whole new soul and heart to something that was already so beautiful. I didn't have a clue what is this about. So I googled some stuff and in the end the director asked me, okay, do you know the play? I said, no. Okay, let's keep it this way. So I'm like <laughs> fresh. <laughs> I just thought these two, because it's a different audience here, it needs to have a different feel about it. You know, it needed to be a bit edgier, a bit grittier, a bit down to the roots. Um, and that's exactly what Drinker and Declan bring as somebody of Irish descent and somebody from Croatia. I will start to cry if I talk about it too much, um, but it's just lovely. I love watching people who can play instruments like that and really act. I mean, that takes years and years of proper hard work and it's just bliss to see it. I mean, we'd heard, heard these mythic rumours passing back from New York about how good it was, uh, and finally we've had it unleashed here. It's stunning. Do you know what? It was just lovely to actually see the musicians and for everybody that's playing it, to have the whole ensemble up there on stage and a real toe tapper, you couldn't help but tap along all the way through.